guys. Christy Clemens with E320 Treasures. Yet another impromptu live. I wasn't gonna go live tonight because I wasn't feeling it, but then something happened and now I'm feeling it. No alcohol involved. Surprising enough to all of you who know me. <laughs> all right, so I realized something. The other night you saw me work on this little area right here on this table and I wanted to fill in this little niche, this little, uh, looks like somebody just hit it really hard and like cracked out some of this. Um, and I put mud on it, but it was like a, you couldn't really tell on camera, but it was like this watery consistency. And I, was, I thought, what did I do wrong? You know, did I, uh, I don't know, did it get too hot? I mean, well, you know what, it just wasn't the consistency that it was supposed to be. And I thought, oh, I just can't. And so a friend of mine suggested, you know, put it in the fridge and uh, so I did. And y'all, my uh, pine cone is still really cold. My pine cone looks just like my mud. So note to self, paint doesn't really fill in holes. So we're gonna try it with the actual stuff. So <laughs> literally I will show you. This is what it was. Like I'm using this going, holy heck, something's wrong. And then, you know, there, there we are with our peanut butter. It is supposed to look like peanut butter. So if you open up your jar and it's runny, check the label. Check the label. Okay. I can't see, let's see. I can't see nothing. I don't know why I can't see comments or anything. Oh, I see Kristen's on. I see the hearts. Oh, there's Terry Ann. Hola. How are you, girlfriend? And Serena. Hi, babe. Serena just did her first live on Chalk Paint 101. So she did an awesome job. Worked on some stencils and some mousse and just really rocked it. Hey, Kristen. <laughs> All right, mud. I mean, it, it doesn't need to drip. So we're going to just go over this part. And I'm going to leave a little extra around it because it's going to shrink a little bit. I'm going to come back and kind of get that groove right there. But I'll come back and sand it later. I'll take that back. I'm going to leave, leave it all solid up there so it kind of helps with the solidarity of it. Get just a little bit more. All right, and as it shrinks, I may have to come back and do another coat with my mud, not my pine cone. Anybody else ever make a mistake like that? Please share. Please make me feel better about myself. I was on the phone with my girlfriend, Serena, and I realized that, and I was like, hey, hold, she's trying to make me feel better about it, and I was like, no, 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 hold on. I'm gonna send you a picture of what I've been working with. All right, one other problem on this little table, not much. We can, it's absolutely fixable. Thank you for the hearts, Kristen. All right, we've got like just two little, it almost looks like fingerprints right here and right here. This is just my first coat of buttercream, by the way. I haven't put on a second coat. Uh, these two little uh, toxins coming through, tannins. Toxins, furniture toxins coming through. So I'm going to put on my Dixie Belle Boss in white. It's a white table, so I'm gonna use the white. Just, I mean, that's probably too much, but it'll do both. And I'm gonna come over it. And that's gonna help me keep those toxins in the table. It may require a second coat. I'm gonna put a second coat on it tomorrow and then come back with a second coat of buttercream. So nobody else has ever made a mistake like that? Come on, you guys, let's be honest. Come on, let's dig. Give, give, me, some, give me some good stories. All right, let's drop down. Oh, before we do that, I just want to show you the two coats of stain on the table is looking pretty good. That's just two coats. Get you closer, closer, closer. You can see where I've wiped it, so I'm still going to give it one more. But it really, uh, it's dark now, so I can't open up the doors or windows. Oop, there's another slacker. And we'll do that tomorrow. 
when I can open up the doors and let the smell out because that is about the one and only uh, Dixie Belle product that kind of has a scent that is not exceptionally pleasant. So here's our table leg. That is the first coat of meow. There's our first coat of uh, buttercream. So with all of the chalk paint, that chalk paint is so porous that it's gonna start soaking up all of your second coat. So if you missed it with water, this is uh, like a, I don't know where I got this, but it's got water in it. And you missed your first coat and then come back. Oh, for crying out loud, I'm trying to get the, the thing open. Oh, and by the way, for those of you who loved my leg warmers, oh look, there's some pine cone on my sock. I wear leg warmers almost every day at work because they keep my leggies warm. All right, buttercream. And then look how it just glides on. So pretty. You want me to sing? Anybody want to sing? I was doing a, a recording last night of some stuff I'm going to be putting on my page later on, and I was singing different things, and my daughter was sitting on the other side of the counter going, ah, Mom, I think, I think singing brings things to life. I love to sing. I love to make a joyful noise. But yes, love to sing. That's not funny. I told everybody to be quiet. They're all back here watching. <laughs> all right, so I'll go over the entire side, the legs, the feet, with a second coat of buttercream. And see how it's going to be so lovely. And then tomorrow, after that's done, I will show you the difference. Ugh, I don't know. Let's just squat down here on the floor. Oh, I feel like a con control, that thing, that person that does all the bendy stuff. I can't think of the word, but no, it's not a bend. Contortionist, contortionist. Yeah, because I'm down here so well. Uh, tomorrow we'll come back and I'll show you the difference between clear coating before or after putting on black wax and show you the difference in how that looks. It's a, two different looks and uh, I like them both. So, uh, Sayonara till tomorrow. I didn't even plan that. That just came out. Okay. <laughs> Good night, y'all.